next on Running, the program that showcases athletes in action. International elites at the front and 15,000 to follow. It's the launch of the holiday season and many are very much in the spirit in the Manchester Road Race in Connecticut, an event with all the trimmings. Feel the need to get away from it all? Get off the grid for a bit? May we suggest the Antarctic Ice Marathon at 80 degrees south latitude. No cheers, no celebrities, no bands, just you and the tundra. Welcome. At the TCS New York City Marathon, the wheelers lead the way and bring athleticism to ground level. They share the competitive workload until the finish line is in sight. God's Love We Deliver gets you going in Central Park to raise funds for those in need. You do your part and they will do theirs. The kids know how to take care of business. Run for life. A great place to start is New York Roadrunners Youth Jamboree at the Armory in Upper Manhattan. The kids run with abandon and they are joined by seniors in the Forever Young Division. Just keep on trucking. Meb has raced the New York City Marathon nine times. He knows how to win and knows how to enjoy the journey. I mean, people love to come to New York just to visit and to have that honor to be able to say, you know what, I ran the New York City Marathon, the biggest marathon in the world, it has an added flavor to it. Kids Run to help other kids in the Ronald McDonald House New York Kids Charity Fun Run. You run because you can, and maybe someday your effort will help sick kids run. But tie your shoes next time. The operative word in the 78th Manchester Road Race in Connecticut, charm. But it might have to wait just a bit while the elites prepare for the start of this Thanksgiving Day Classic. In the blue, 2012 winner Aaron Braun of Colorado. Janet Balcom is a U.S. Olympian and holds the American 10-mile record. Have fun. Diane Nakuri Johnson knows the course well and was third here in 2012. I'm good, how are you? There you go. Oh, yeah. Have a good one. Number four, Sam Chalenga is the defending champion. And on his shoulder, training partner number 19, Ben True. The first half mile of this Thanksgiving Day Classic is a straight shot down Main Street. Locals have run or volunteered here for generations, passing the torch to those that gladly follow. This is the 78th edition of this event, making it one of the oldest and most renowned in the country. Costumes add some spice to the meat and potatoes, and back here, there is no place for a stopwatch. $130,000 will be given to local charities and nonprofit organizations. An elite international field of men and women leads the way, chasing $46,000 in prize money to be sorted at the finish line. Tracking footage courtesy of Chaplin Kawasaki, your family motor fun destination. Visit ChaplinKawasaki.com to join the fun. The race is acknowledged to be the start of the holiday season, and Kate Smith makes it official. To the women's race. In the early going, in the green, it's Sally Kip Yego of Kenya, an Olympic silver medalist and two-time winner here. Defending champ Chalenga and Ben True break away, and the holiday crowds begin to get in the spirit. Back on Main Street, it's sidewalk to sidewalk. At the top of the Highland Street Hill, Sam Chalenga goes for the UPS Freight King of the Hill Prime worth $1,000. Ben True seems content to let Sam have the payday. Neely Spence wants an early payday too. She surges from the field and takes the $1,000 Prime. Over the hill, it's Sam Chalenga. 
than True. True and Chilenga both have good closing speed, so this could be a shootout. Back on Main Street, the Walkers have joined the party. At the four mile mark, it's True and Chilenga, joined by Andrew Colley, a five time All American at NC State. Okay, stay with him, because this is the race. Bolting from the resting pack, Diane De Curry Johnson of Burundi surges to the lead on the downhill. This is her fifth appearance at Manchester, so she knows the downhill finish up ahead. The colors welcome one and all. True and Chilenga, 500 yards to go. The downhill slingshots you to the finish line. Chilenga makes his bid for victory, but True has just one more gear and uses it wisely. Ben True, Sam Chilenga, and Andrew Colley. Diana Curie Johnson of Burundi in her fifth Manchester takes the gold. And our top female, Mariel Hall. Congratulations to Mariel. Road racing is as American as apple pie, and today you get an extra large slice. On race day, the action is not restricted to the pavement. Regarding the rules of competition, other than crossing the starting line and finish line, there are none. A dinner with all the trimmings for this hungry group. Officials were unsure as to whether number 5469 should be placed in the male or female category, so they went with other. The Manchester Road Race, for some a decades-long string of starts. For others, one start will lead to so many more. A community on the move for the greater good of all. Now, the holiday season can truly begin.